salary increase for science and math teachers. The Royo seeks salary hike for science and math teachers. Former President and Pampanga Representative Gloria Arroyo has introduced a bill that will raise the wage grade of current science and mathematics teachers by two steps. The Developing Globally Competitive Science and Mathematics Teachers Act of 2022, which was proposed by Arroyo, would raise the salaries of current public school science and math teachers who did not major in those subjects but have been teaching for at least two years, as certified by the principal of the school and the district supervisor, by two salary grades. Current scientific and math instructors who are not majoring in those subjects will receive the aforementioned pay raise once they have completed a merit test in that area, which will be given by the Department of Education with the assistance of the Department of Science and Technology. House Deputy Speaker Arroyo said that, in our genuine effort to be major players in the global arena, it is of paramount importance to have exceptional and highly educated students. But without the contribution of our teachers in the molding of our youth, it will be close to impossible to create such an ideal student tree. This bill will ensure that teaching in the fields of science and mathematics will be as competitive as those of other professions, and thus increase the number of competent teachers who will prepare Filipinos for global excellence, former Philippine President Arroyo emphasized. The salary grade of entry-level public school teachers is salary grade 11 or around P12,000 a month. If the bill is passed into law, it will increase to salary grade 13. Similarly, the bill offers the following advantages to science and math majors who choose to pursue careers as science and mathematics teachers. Priority in government scholarship grants, allowances, study visits, placement, publications, and research support, wherever appropriate to teachers and students who enroll in science or mathematics teaching courses. Temporary waiver of the requirements under Section 13, Article 3 of Republic X 7836 requiring undergoing a written licensure examination for teachers given by the Professional Regulation Commission, PRC, and securing a valid certificate of registration and professional license from PRC to allow new Bachelor of Science in Education graduates majored in science and mathematics to be employed as science and math teachers provided that such graduates will undergo the licensure examination and secure PRC license within one year from date of employment. Specialized continuing education and training in science and math teaching in rewards and recognition in cash and in kind to new Bachelor of Science in Education graduates who majored in science or mathematics who made it to the top 20 in the licensure examinations for teachers by the PRC. Furthermore, the bill also permits graduates of science degree courses to teach science or mathematics in public or private elementary and secondary schools for not more than three years, provided that indefinite extension or permanent appointment may be given to science degree graduates who have passed their respective licensure examinations and earned at least 10 units of teaching pedagogy and passed the licensure examination for teachers before being permanently appointed as science or mathematics teachers. Arroyo's bill also mandates the Philippine Amusement and Gaming Corporation to grant the Department of Education a supplementary appropriation worth 500 million pesos for the first year of the proposed bill's implementation. For the years to follow, the financial appropriation will be provided under the General Appropriations Act or the National Budget Law. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay updated and informed. Comment down your thoughts below.